In Imo State, the Nigerian Army says it is determined to decimate the enemies of the state who have instilled fear in the minds of citizens through their clandestine activities in some part of the country. The Chief of Army Staff gave this assurance at the interdenominational service to mark this year's Army Day celebration in Oweri, the Imo State capital. Prince Oba reports. <laughs> Nigerian Army is celebrating 159 years of its existence. Officers and men, their wives and the entire congregation of St. Mark's Military Church, 34 Atlari Brigade Obinze Owere, are here to thank God for the progress made these years. For the Chief of Army Staff, who was represented by Major General Victor Ezu, the military is resilient in its effort to defend the nation's territorial integrity. We know that we have security challenges across the country, and we're not sleeping over it. We are doing our utmost best to make sure we address this situation. Our effort is going to be successful. We are going to defeat our enemies. Nigeria Army has never lost any war, both civil and international, both within the country and outside the country. And by the grace of God, we gave thanks today, we are going to be victorious over our enemies. So I'm just appealing for patience and calm and support to the Nigerian army so that we can do the needful to make Nigeria a more safer country. In his sermon, the acting director of chaplain services, Roman Catholic, Reverend Father Anthony Mai Magani, urged Nigerians to use all means to promote national unity. It is our duty, all of us, Men and women of all rank and file, of each and every profession, and of any and all faith, to seek for ways and means to promote peaceful coexistence, religious and ethnic tolerance, and mutual love and harmony in our society. Despite numerous challenges facing the country, the Nigerian army says it will continue with its constitutional responsibility of protecting the country from all forms of threats and invasion. Prince Oba, TVC News, Uwere.